हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज रुदिका मिश्रा एंड दिस इज अमन माइशोई फ्रॉम साइड ऑन लैब वेलकम बैक टू आवर चैनल दिस इज द फर्स्ट वीकली अपडेट फॉर आवर कोर्स एप्लीकेशन टुडे वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग द लेटेस्ट अपडेट मेड इन कोर्स व्हिच इज एन ओपन सोर्स वेब एप्लीकेशन डिजाइंड फॉर रियल टाइम सिग्नल विजुलाइजेशन पार्टिकुलरली टेलर्ड फॉर बायोपोटेंशियल सिग्नल्स लाइक ईजी ईसीजी ईओजी एंड ईएमजी लिंक्स फॉर द वेब एप्लीकेशन एज वेल एज गिटहब रिपोजिटरी can be found in the description box below so without further ado let's get started in previous video we have discussed that how to make connection with application and ordno boards in order to visualize biopotential signals cords offer various features like recording data pausing data auto scaling you can download that recorded file in form of csp file and you can delete that file if you don't want to download that file you can increase or decrease channels as per your requirements before moving forward i'll recommend you to watch previous video for better understanding you can find that link somewhere on the top right corner to use the application let's directly go to the cords.afsideonlabs.tech there were some issues regarding the alignment and user interface on this page which we have fixed in this version we have already uploaded the arduino firmware So let's directly click on visualize now and then let's connect. Here you will be able to visualize the data. You can see the ECG signals on the screen. Then we can increase the number of channels according to our need. We have also made changes to the user interface canvas representation for better visualization. Let's dive into major updates and enhancements since last update. The biggest upgrade is our switch to WebGL plot for data visualization. Previously we used smoothie chart library but it often resulted in lag and less smooth experience Now with webgl plot biopotential signals visualization is more smoother and responsive improving the data accuracy and clarity of your data Previously we had an auto scale button to adjust data view we have replaced that with zoom in and zoom out feature giving you more control as now you can either zoom in at the data point and zoom out for overall view webgl plot is more powerful library it ensures efficient and accurate data rendering for biopotential signals without lag even when plotting multi channel data simultaneously cords is getting better day by day with each updates this time with the integration of webgl plot the data visualization is smoother and the new zoom feature gives you the better control over your data Thanks for watching don't forget to check out complete documentation of cords application link will be in the description box below feel free to share your thoughts ideas and suggestions in comment box we would like to hear from you stay tuned for more updates thank you thank you bye bye tata see you